Yo, what's up, dudes? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy coming at you with another video. And today it seems like it is the day for leaks of Black Ops 3. And I figured this was going to happen. I, I knew that whenever the PC beta came out, we were going to have so much leaked information that it was going to be just a, like an influx of information. So I'm going to be trying to cover it as best as I can. If you guys stick around with the channel, I will be covering every single leak that happens. So first of all, we got leaked weapons that are, you know, uh, some new added to the to the list that we already have so uh before we saw that the mp7 and the power bolt were leaked and now we've got two new shotguns it looked like two lmgs the m27 and what's really cool about the lmgs is one is a seven uh burst fire lmg which that should be really interesting to see um i'll post a link in the description to the leaked images i'm not going to put them on the video just because i don't want a copyright strike from activision please do not strike this video down i thank you base god so um yeah, it's, it's on Charlie Intel, so you guys can check the link in the description for that. And I just wanted to talk about that really quick. Um, the, the weapons look like they're placeholders. I doubt these are going to be the actual in-game uh, screenshots because uh, one of them looked like it was the Remington shotgun from Black Ops 2, uh, which obviously that might be just, you know, old code. We don't really know. They could be updating the weapon, and uh, they just put that in there kind of as a placeholder. That's my guess. In some cases, whenever you deal with code, you do put placeholder text and sometimes images uh, just to kind of give you a you know idea of how you want things to look. So I can definitely see that this stuff might be placeholders. Who knows? We might actually get these weapons in the game. Now, the next bit of huge information we got revealed or leaked, I should say, and that is Nuketown is coming back to Black Ops 3. And this was actually leaked by my buddy Long Sensation, and this was on the Brazil PlayStation Store. And the description says, get the bonus Nuketown map. This map, which is among fan favorites and was completely redesigned from the ground up to highlight the new chain-based movement system based on the Treyarch momentum, uh, providing battles of full of adrenaline. So uh, from what it looks like, Nuketown is going to be in Black Ops 3. I kind of expected that just because, you know, it's Nuketown. It's been in the last, like, three Black Ops games. So it's only, you know, it's only right that it's going to be in Black Ops 3. So it's kind of expected. I'm really, like, you know, curious to see how they change the map around uh, because, you know, the new movement system is very diverse. And uh, Nuketown is not the map to be, you know, running on, you know, two walls. So I can't wait to see how it looks in this new game. And I'm ready to, you know, get on the battlefield and start whooping some kids. Uh, so yeah, that's all for this video, guys. If you could do me a favor and slap a like on this video. And if you have not yet subscribed to my channel, be sure to do that as well. Uh, thank you all for watching this video again. And until next time, this has been your boy Nemo, and I'm out. Peace. Bring the madness.